You created your own bird feeders. You had to think about how to design a feeder that would be easy for birds to use. You had to figure out things like, where would birds stand? How would they reach the food? Here are some of the bird feeders that we designed. These tray feeders are flat and open for birds that like to stand in the feeders and eat the seeds. Those are birds like jays and cardinals. We also made feeders with pegs, places to perch. For that, we used chopsticks and pencils as our perches. These feeders would be good for birds like goldfinches that like to stand on small pegs to reach the seeds inside the feeder. Lastly, we designed feeders for woodpeckers, which like to eat while holding onto the sides of the bird feeders with their feet. For that, we used pipe cleaners on our feeders to make little handles where woodpeckers could grab onto. These were just some of the ways you could have designed your feeders. Maybe you came up with something totally different. The purpose was to create a prototype, a first version of a bird feeder to test out your ideas. You built your prototype out of materials like paper cups and plates and other things that are easy to find in a classroom. These aren't the kinds of materials that would hold up outside in the rain or in the wind. But you could use your prototype to design a real feeder made out of sturdier, more expensive materials like wood or metal or plastic, and then hang it up to see which birds it attracted. We've seen how bird feeders attract different species of birds, depending on which kind of food they use, whether a feeder has seeds like this one or sugar water like this one. And some feeders can even have fruit like bananas or oranges. But it's not just about the kind of food. It's also really important to think about how the feeder is designed. Even if feeders have the same kinds of food, different feeders are designed for different birds with places for birds to stand or perch. And don't forget, the species of birds you'll see also depends on where you live. In this mystery, we looked at birds in North America, like jays and cardinals. But in other parts of the world, you can find other species of birds at bird feeders. For example, in Australia, you might find rainbow lorikeets visit your bird feeder. Or in South America, you might have toucans. To learn more about what species of birds you have in your area and what they like to eat, you can check out the link to the Project Feeder Watch in the extras. Have fun and stay curious.